Hi. Today I'm going to talk about BTS and why I'm so obsessed with them and why you should be obsessed with them too. For those of you who don't know, BTS are a K-pop boy band made of seven members. Seven, the magic number. They are a global sensation at the moment as they're the biggest boy band in the world, I think, right now. Brilliant in every sense of the word. So this is my story and how I came to be obsessed with them. I became an ARMY, which is what we call ourselves if we are part of a BTS fandom. It stands for Adorable Representative MC for Youth. I am an ARMY and I became one when my best friend introduced me to them. So for me, it was a gradual process. It took me quite long to become fully immersed and obsessed with them, mainly because of where I was in my life at that moment. And that was when I was studying for A-levels. You really have to be immersed in what you're learning and you have to be on it all the time because if you're not, then you could fall behind and you know, you won't do that well in your exams. So the main goal for me at that time was doing well in my A-levels. So that's why I didn't really plunge myself into BTS at that point. But when they came to the O2 to perform, that was when I got fully obsessed. Like I got fully into them and just watched loads of videos and all their dance practices and learned who they were and everything. From that point onwards, I was obsessed. Number one is their songs and their meanings. Not only do they sound nice, but when you actually read the English translation, you know what they're singing about. They're so meaningful and deep and full of soul and they can really resonate with you and your situation. What they sing about is amazing and they can really help change your life. Their main message is learning to love yourself. And even though that in some ways to some people that, that might sound kind of shallow, it's really not because loving yourself is like the first step on the long journey towards your happiness. You will find that that's true once you actually start to love yourself. BTS did help me to love myself, not just through their song lyrics, but I started to learn their dances. Every album they release, they have a few songs in which they have choreographed dances. For every song, they have a different dance, which I think is amazing. And the level standard of their dancing is top, not world class BTS, world class. The amount of love and admiration I have for them is insane. It's through the roof. It's amazing how much work they put into their dancing, their lyrics, how many hours goes into putting things together for us, ARMY, the fan base. That's why the fan base ARMY are so appreciative of BTS and that's why BTS love ARMY. They need to go together. BTS loves ARMY, ARMY loves BTS. Because we are dependent on each other for everything. ARMY depends on BTS for their happiness and BTS depends on ARMY for their success and their happiness. I don't actually have anyone to perform to but we do, I do record them and then try and improve them as best we can. I actually do the dances with my sister and her best friend. We have like our own dance crew and we learn all the BTS dances that we can. So far we've learned six I think, six dances. We need to actually film a few of them for real when we wear our outfits for the specific videos. So their lyrics are amazing, their message telling you to love yourself. Over time it actually works. Their dancing is amazing, their commitment to their work that you can physically see and hear when you listen to BTS. How much love they have for ARMY, how much they give back to us. They give so much content for us to enjoy and watch and learn about who they really are, what they're like as people, what they like to do in their spare time. They do loads of vlogs. They, they have a series called Bon Voyage where 
BTS go on holiday to different locations, get to see what they're like on holiday. They have something called Run BTS, which comes out every week, every Tuesday. We see them do lots of different challenges, which I'd actually like to try some myself and film them and put them on my blog. So maybe you'll see some of that later. In their albums, they give us so much, like it's not just a CD, you get a photo book, a photo card, a postcard, and you get the lyric book, the notes. I'll do a video of my unboxing of my albums as well. They're just lovely, lovely people as well when you get to know them. Really, really fantastic, fantastic, cutie, lovely people. So I'm going to introduce you to them. Kim Taehyung, my favourite, my bias as we call it, also known as V. This is Min Yoongi, also known as Sugar or Augusty. This is Kim Sok Jin, also known as Jin. This is Kim Nam Jun, also known as RM or That Monster. This is J Hope, also known as Hobby or Jung Ho Suk. This is Park Jimin, also known as Jimin or Chin Chin. And this is John Jungkook, also known as Jungkook or JK. JK. That's all the BTS members. And this is a poster on my wall. Showcasing how much I love them. I have a few other posters from my other albums, but I haven't put them up because it's a commitment to put command strips to your wall. Because once you take them down, you can't use those command strips again. So I'll have to figure out how I'm going to display those posters. That is why I love BTS and that is why you should also love BTS. Obviously you can't just straight away love something, so get into BTS. I would recommend watching maybe a couple of performances, Blood, Sweat and Tears, or Fake Love, and watch the music video. Very amazing stuff. I first got into them by watching some of their videos on YouTube, their music videos, and then I started listening and discovering more songs on Spotify while I was doing uni work. And then when I put the two together, the songs and the video, amazing, amazing stuff. So yes, that is why I'm obsessed with BTS. Maybe in another video, I'll go through all the merch that I own and how I came to own them. I do not know what I would do if BTS split up. I would be devastated and I think the entire world of armies would cry and sob in sorrow for many years after they split. ARMY are dependent on BTS. It would be a huge loss to the world of happiness and entertainment. They have to go to the military at some point before they're 30 and they're all in their 20s still. So that will be a stressful time when they have to go to the military. That's two years without BTS. We'll see how we'll cope. I'll show you the members and you can learn the fan chant with me. The fan chant goes Kim Nam Jun, Kim Sok Jin, Min Yong Gi, Jong Ho Sok, Park Jae Min, Kim Tae Young, John Jung Kook, BTS! Woo! Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe and comment and let me know your stories of how you got into BTS. Thanks for watching.